Welcome back, Colonels. Today, we are reacting to Men in Black 3. Hey guys, I hope you're all having a great Wednesday afternoon. I'm currently recording this on a Tuesday, but I know I probably won't be getting it out until Wednesday. So we've been watching the Men in Black series for a couple weeks now. We watched the first one about a month ago. Uh, just last week, we finished watching the second one. And today we're going to kind of finish out the trilogy with the third one. Now, this is the one I'm most excited to watch because, one, it takes place in 2012. I know it has time travel in it. I know Josh Brolin is in it. So, and this is the one I've seen a few clips from, like, where he jumps off the building. Um, that's all I know about this movie, so I'm pretty excited to have a more, maybe, hopefully, better CGI um, Men in Black movie. Even though the CGI has been, like, creepy good. Like... I don't know it's it's very it was very like 90s early 2000s type cgi in terms of you know aliens and stuff so real quick before we dive into this movie reaction if you are new here subscribe or do whatever you have to do so you don't miss any other reactions let's dive into men in black 3 i feel this one's gonna be better oh who is that boris boris has got his birthday cake Oh, something is, that cake is alive. Like some kind of cake. Now you're on an airplane and the flight attendant asks you to turn your cell phone off and you're like, I ain't turning my cell phone off. That don't have nothing to do with no damn airplane. Well, <laughs> this is what we get. We'll check the composition of the fuel units and run a scan on the surface deposits. I want to know who was driving that thing. Cool. Yes, so what are you going to say tonight? Uh, don't worry. No, I'm very worried. <laughs> Are those lizard dudes or the little dude? Oh, please tell me they're back. Yes! I love them. Okay. I worked the Zed for over 40 years, and in all that time, he never invited me to dinner. He never asked me to his house to watch a game. He never shared a single detail of his personal life. Thank you. What? <laughs> now we will hear from our new chief. Agent O. About Zed's passing, she said something that I'm going to repeat, and I'm paraphrasing. <clears throat> okay. All right. That was more moving than his speech. And I just spit everywhere, so enjoy that, everyone. Who is this? Is he playing rock band? Oh, it's Boris! Oh, here we go. Hey, what do you guys want to bust my balls for, huh? <laughs> no, no balls, man. <laughs> That's what a bust my balls for, huh? You look like what is that? Planet. Damn. Planet. Bob here is a clear violation. Is that the now? ugly Not fish? Oh. Selling unlicensed extraterrestrial. I never knew the ugly the, the blob fish was in that this. Is ah. I don't know anybody. All right, you slug. Whoa, whoa. Uh, whoa. Uh, that baby know, didn't do anything. I used to play a game with my dad called Catch. So I, I would throw the ball and it would just hit the wall because he wasn't there. Don't bad mouth your old man. That's awful. I'm not bad mouthing him. I just I didn't really know him. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, get him. Very much. I see the arm I shot off is still shot off. 
<laughs> yes, my arm. But first, I want the pleasure of killing you. You okay? <laughs> Where the hell are you, man? Oh, my God. God. <laughs> you don't know it, Kay, but you're already dead. Okay, you know your kid won the goldfish in that little baggie from the school <laughs> fair and you didn't want that nasty thing in your house, so you told your kid it ran away, but what you really did was flush it down the toilet? Well, this is what happens. How do your kids? <laughs> I love the, the stories behind the, like, why, the reasons that they give. That's a shocker. Yeah, the upgraded Men in Black headquarters is way cooler now, though. That's cool. Okay. Agent K received highest commendation for heroic action. You know, that's not what I'm asking you. Cape Canaveral, what happened? Something that changed him. Leave it at that. I want to know. So you two go way back, huh? You know the most destructive force in the universe? Sugar? Regret. You don't have to wait, just talk. I promise you the secrets of the universe, nothing more. What if it's like he's an alien? Dude, that would be like the ultimate twist. <laughs> wait, is it that other people's house? From the second movie? Is that what this is? Looks like it, kinda. Oh, he knows he's coming for him. Oh. Damn. Can I help you? Why is there... Hey, what? Why? Why did you I'm do sorry. that? Okay. All right. You got me. Oh. I'll give it to you. That, it's funny. That and very dude. Elaborate. That oh, dude. He he, he rewinded time. Performances. Can't believe you waited 14 For years he to did develop something. a sense of humor. But older gentleman, 110, maybe 111 years old. Sort of a surly Elvis thing happening with him. He smiles like this. Seen him around? Black incident report, July 1969. Location, Cape Canaveral. Perpetrator boards the animal, escaped and fled Earth. Assumed to have returned to home planet Bangladesh, 20 light years away. Agent K pronounced dead at scene and awarded posthumous commendation for meritorious action, which- For every stakeout, endless hours of cowboy music. For every morning with his coffee. If Boris could work out how to time jump, he, he could seriously change the course of history. Attention. Early warning system engaged. Inbound hostile warships entering solar system. Oh, Bob it's Boris. Hi, how can I help Yeah, you? here we go. This is the part I've seen. Batteries. Well, okay, we got other stuff like headphones, adapters, or... You help Boris the animal time jump. Oh, that's a big blip. Okay. What's the plan? You're gonna send me back to July 15th, 1969. No, that... You know the rules of time jumps, right? Give me the short version. Okay. You wanna save your partner, word of advice, stay away from him. Yeah, they got it. Stay away from K, just kill bars. Now, now, all you gotta do is jump. Hey, hey, stop, stop. Now, yeah. as soon as you're moving fast Let's enough, go. that circle's gonna fill up with some sort of green time travel liquid or some such. In 1969, wasn't the best time for your people. What? Just, or you won't. It was a lot. It wasn't a good time for your people is a crazy thing to say. Go. Nice. 
That's so cool. He's there! Yeah! Oh wait, there's Boris the animal right there! No, I'm just kidding. It kind of did look like a... <gasps> Boris the animal! <laughs> Yo, Boris the animal! Officially, my new favorite alien in this series. Power windows, power seats. I'll bet you the thing costs six grand, man. Uh, yes, and it has a roof. Oh, are but they being hidden. racist? Hey, what kind of work do you do? Oh, they are being racist. Ah, jeez. See, my lawyer, before you press that small button on the side firmly. Press it. <laughs> He's a smart man. And just because you see a black man driving in a nice car, does not mean it's stolen. I stole that one, but not because I'm black. <laughs> I stole that one, but not because I'm black. Let's agree to disagree. No, he already got him. Take it from here. Okay. K! K! <laughs> Is Josh Brolin playing young Agent K? All right, sir. I was minding my own business. I was out there waiting for my girl, who, by the way, is probably worried. Just tell him you're a time traveler. Right now. Like, why so does it matter? I, I he's already to, seen aliens. It's like he's bound to, to believe you. Man. No, I call ladies O. To me, O is feminine, K is masculine. You know, I see a couple. I'm like. K O. Oh. Okay. Just one last thing. An eye exam. No. Is that the neuralizer? Do not arrest him. Kill him. You tell him about time travel and all this stuff. Yeah. Agent K. What's he still doing here? I might have cooked him for too long. Thought I'd better walk him out. I put my pants on. <laughs> I put my pants on. It's a matchbook. No, it's a clue. He didn't smoke. He's just trying to smile at him, get him to show some kind of emotion. Um, you need to see the boss. He's busy. Mm. Right, they well, look like look they look like uh, Tweedledee and Tweedledum from Alice in Wonderland. Oh my God! Oh, you did not just walk into my establishment and rip my head off. My man, look, we don't have a lot of time for this. You really need to tell him something. I'll tell him this, buddy. For the first time, you are miserable ass pig hunter. Tough spare, God. Slick. You messed with the wrong head! Well, we're on the right track. It's the wrong train. If you had any secrets, I'm guessing he spilled them. Smart man would figure out what your victims have in common. Smart man would. No deal. Come on, man. I've been an agent for 14 years, which means that I'm the senior agent on this case. Now, I hate to pull rank, but as senior agent, I'm instructing my junior agent, that's you, to give me my gun right now. That's an order. He's not an alien. Oh my god. Very nice. Link. That's good. God damn it, Katie! Were you trying to blow my cover? Hey, Agent W, your cover is safe. See here. <laughs> What's that, dumbass? Say it again. Is that Bill Hader? Yeah, that's Bill Hader. Who's that guy? Okay, don't tell me he's your new partner. Actually, he's my old partner. He traveled back from the future to save the planet. Jeez. <laughs> Whip it! Got him! Get that animal! I don't know, it has a 
hasn't happened yet. Come on, what about you, Slick? Oh, you no, the Boris thing is girl? what does it to him, I bet. I got you. I cannot believe this. Freaking New York Mets. Total losers. We got there, Hoss. The Arcanon said, it's amazing, it's a miracle. I'll see you at the game. I know where he is. Told you to trust the pie. Griffin's here for a game. He's either too early or too late. He's here. Just got oh, that was such a cool shot. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, Mets. Let's Griffin. go, Mets. Oh, you're just in time. Can help him see, okay. So this is how you see things. This is amazing. It's a gigantic pain in the ass, but it has its moments. It's been thrown for the last out of game five, manufactured in 1962 by the Spalding factory of Chicago. Good lord, this dude doesn't shut up! Flawed. Dude. Shield. Arcane and Arcnet. That's what you did. You put up the Arcnet. How did I do that? When that ball is pitched to Davy Johnson, who only became a baseball player because. Oh dear. I forgot to see this one. Oh! Ah! Damn, Boris! Yo, bro, Boris is badass. Driver settings at zero gain. Balance pitching y'all with short bursts on the center stalk between 80 and 100 psi. Who is like my minimum? <laughs> Destruction of burn! Dude, this is the best man in black movie by far. Look at this. Yeah, but he got that box. I mean... Yep. I feel younger already. And that's what... Yep. You pathetic waste of boglodite flesh. It defeat me. You spend the next 40 years in prison. Chained up like an animal. No prison can hold me. They build one especially for oh. us on the moon. <laughs> oh. What's your plan? I want to see his actual eyes. He's the dude. He's the coolest alien in this show, in the series so far. Oh, thank you for saving my life. That's well, what we do. He really it's reminds me of net. Joaquin Phoenix. When you're being hunted by Boris the animal, you get good at hiding things. Whoa. What do you mean alone? It means I'm going to go to Florida, you're going to stay here, and I need you to trust me on this one. Trust you? I don't think so. Something you're not telling me, Slick? I'm telling you you're not going to Florida. Well, that ain't going to happen, Yep, partner. he's going. You die there. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, Canaveral, Apollo launch. Well, kind of. He's not gonna believe him though, because he's like, well, if you're my partner, yeah, look, he's gonna be like, if, if, if you're my partner. I saw the file, I looked at the report. Now, I, now, I know I said I told you everything, but you got- Oh! That's for lying to me. But where there is death, there will always be death. So maybe Boris the animal. Yeah, he's, he's, they're trying to, watch this. I guarantee you they're trying to say that like Will Smith is gonna die. Like, if, oh, well, if he doesn't die, you'll die. It's gonna be Boris the animal that dies. Someone's gotta die there, right? 
we pull this off, fix things the way they were, O and I, are, we, wise man once told me, don't ask questions you don't want to know the answer to. Can't drive to Florida from Manhattan in five hours, Chief. Yeah, yeah, we can. The, the red button, standard issue in every MIB car, you press the red button, goes into hyperdrive. No red buttons yet, Slick. I swear he has like a new love interest in every movie. <laughs> that looks so weird. Let's go. So glad this isn't one of the times we explode. One of the times. Yes, sir, it is. Oh, God. Good day, gentlemen. We're, we're here Great to stop Boris America, the isn't? animal. That worked. Like a charm. Sir, Delta Gate, we may have a problem. Three trespassers, no IDs, but they've got weapons, sir. Some kind I've never seen before. Sir, this man came here from the future to protect me, so I can attach a shield to the top of that rocket and save the world. I need your help to do that. Take him to the Yeah! Bridge. I'm slipping, Griff. Oh. Sir, I, if I may. Oh! He shows him. Okay. Cool. Follow me. Get there, get there, come on. How? I want to know how Boris the animal already got in there. Where's Griffin? What his own thing. go wrong not gonna have a chance to either uh, yeah, yeah see why i recruited you but maybe things will change in the sense that he won't he'll kill him that would be better there he is i'll take this one Naughty. damn you might want to get a yeah, pedicure right? and get a second <laughs> oh grab it Lift off. Bro, he's got some balls, man. He ain't afraid of nothing. No! Okay. Bro, Boris needs to see a chiropractor. I wonder if they look like little... Scrub the launch. They knew about it. Get out! But why didn't Will Smith just jump off? Yep. 
There you go. Look out! Go ahead. Rest. Oh, yeah! Not this time. Where there's death, there will always be death. My name's Kay. What's your name? James. James? No way! What do you got there? What is that? My dad gave it to me. We talked a lot. No way! <gasps> oh no, he wipes his memory of it. No! James. Oh my god. What? Damn. That's a really good question. Did we go to Woo's last night? Yeah. Boglodites? Been extinct for 40 years. Perfect. Did we talk on the phone last night? You hung up on me. I think y'all might have friends. Yeah. Right too. I think so too. This is my new favorite moment in human history. Yeah! Bruh! <laughs> Almost forgot. That was a close one. <laughs> I think that was possibly the best Men in Black ending out of all three of them. I like the first and the second one. Definitely the first one more than the second one. This is easily better than both of those i feel like like the ending i did not see coming at all i know they kind of talked about his dad in this movie and like they did foreshadow things now that i think about it a little bit but the whole thing of his dad being that guy and then i don't know i didn't i didn't see it coming at all and i really i just think it was awesome i i think I think I want another Men in Black movie after International, but I, we're probably not going to get that because um, the guy who plays K is... He, he was old in this, so he's probably way too old now. But I would still like to see another one regardless. Um, thank you guys so much for watching with me. I don't know. I've really loved watching the men in black movies i think that we need more stuff like this and not always just like actually like weird sci-fi like mystery stuff i want to react to more stuff like this for you guys so thank you all so much for watching and stay tuned because i think my next movie reaction i'm going to be doing for you guys is gladiator in coming up for gladiator 2 because i've never actually seen the first gladiator um so take so stay tuned for that and i will see you all in the next video peace guys